VROC, also known as viscometer rheometer on a chip, is a revolutionary technology that combines microfluidics with MEMS pressure sensors to redefine capillary viscometers. How is it different from conventional capillary tube viscometers? VROC uses laminar flow in rectangular slit capillary to determine the viscosity of a fluid. But there are key differences compared to traditional technology. Instead of relying on gravity for flow, VROC uses a pumping system to impose specific and controlled flow rates. Instead of measuring the time the fluid takes to travel through the capillary or kinematic viscosity, VROC uses pressure sensors in the flow channel to measure the force required to pump the fluid through. This resistance of the fluid to flow is the actual definition of viscosity. The last key difference? Size. Why is this important? Because it allows to characterize not only Newtonian fluids like water, but also non-Newtonian fluids like polymer melts, concentrated antibody solutions, cream, and more. Dynamic viscosity is a more fundamental property independent of density that's useful to study molecular interaction. Size is probably the most important difference with all viscometry methods. VROC viscometers require about 1.5 microliters, which is less than one quarter of a teardrop. Its small size also results in very low Reynolds numbers, avoiding turbulence or flow instabilities at extremely fast flows. These are some advantages of RioSense's viscometers. Want to learn more? Visit us at riosense.com.